Hey everyone, welcome to your heart read and this is going to be for all the signs and sending you love all the way from India, Bharat, Namaste. I have my Instagram and the links are easily available. Also I have my PayPal. If you want to support and donate to the channel, you may do so via that. It reaches to me faster, okay? Also, other sources are there. To book private readings, you have two. You need to mail me for us. I'll give, you know, forward you an introduction mail and further we proceed again with the PayPal and, you know, the, the, the payments and all that. So, you've been talking with someone for a while and need not to say that, okay, this is 24-7, people are doing their stuff, but this connection is on. So, you're talking with someone for a while. Hmm, it's, it's interesting, but uh, the main message that is, it's something connected with, the, when you see a mirror reflection, th there's a mirror reflection and something which gives you that reflection, suddenly there's a light and... And there's a wake up. What was that? Someone is uh, trying or they've done it and now, okay, when someone tries, it's going to be catching someone's attention. Okay? One thing. It's kind of energy when there's a reflection of the light and you're like, and then you see. Right? So this kind of situation I can see from either side. Catching attention. Each other catching attention <laughs> and does that make sense um, and yes and when you catch attention of each other towards each other means you people end up talking you're talking with someone for a while and this is what is all attention someone is giving you attention you're giving someone attention then talking and you blah 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 and this, this blah is not anything negative it's something that you, it's personal to you Whatever you people are talking and connecting, it's personal to you. So I don't want to say that. No, I don't. I will not. It's their personal thing. <sighs> Something is really personal to this person, which may be specific about you. There's a lot of whisper. This is what the talk is all about, <laughs> which is interesting. You people are talking. It's personal talk. No one can interfere. No one should. It's like end-to-end -end encrypted. Right? This is why it's interesting and this is why it is important that we catch the reading on the go, on camera, and what is happening with the cards. <laughs> This is why it's interesting. Let's see. There's a lot of patience. There's a bottom energy, seven of pentacles. This could be years of wait. This could be just patience and knowing the other person. And then after this wait and everything, you see something suddenly growing and with the flash, like a mirror reflection. You, you understand, right? When the camera is on, it's a flash, okay? And you're, if, you're comfort, if you're not comfortable, you're going to be like this. But it's also something that is reflected like with the camera. Uh, sorry, with the mirror. And you get the reflection on your eyes or someone is trying to catch your attention. And this is what is happening here. Especially with Seven of Pentacles. Like something is happening and what what's that glittery thing? What is that is sparkly thing? What is that spark? There's a spark. And now we are going to see this. This is interesting. Okay. So, <laughs> what is that? Mm. These two cards. Ooh, Knight of Chalices. Talking for a while. Someone who admires you. Someone could be even, you know, in a hidden way, secretly feeling something for you or keeping the feelings inside as a secret. Or you know, but they're not just out with words more. But there's going to be something suddenly. Appearance. Appearing. Okay. Now this is so important. You have two of Chalices. Oh, wow. And the Empress. You, they're under your spell. They've been under your spell and this is like reignition of spell because this was on and on and on and on for possible years. If this suits you, this reading is for you. Okay. This is a promise of long time coming, a longing and there's a reunion. I feel like it happened 
in last week or two weeks or last two days and this is also projecting the energy around full moon or something kind of moon energy and a promise it's a new beginning as well the two of chalices is like heart to heart connection of hearts was supposed to be happening and it's a long time coming as i said it's a longing there is some kind of uh, indication of a travel in 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 chart as well for you or for this person or for both of you it depends on common spot or whoever is coming or arriving but you know what this is a very important connection you hold very important place and they are under your spell kind of like however this can go vice versa but they are under your spell and it's like it was it was never it never felt negative and that's why i said that this this spell is so positive that it's a natural spell i don't know how it works for you but someone who does want to be in that spell like they can break it they can forget about you but they can't because they don't want also universe doesn't want you to go away you know the, the <sighs> it's kind of like oh my god it's so heavy oh my god like you know oh my god but then again okay whatever that is i still want to think about this person it's kind of happy love a bunny love it's a sweet love it is what it is like it's kind of like you drew someone's attention if you're a female listening to me honey you just new always sort of like in last few readings that i did somewhere here there of course on my channel but i don't know whether it's aquarius or general because i do that um because there was an announcement i did that i just want to put all my energy in in uh, the general readings like heart readings and aquarius readings for now because i just had the calling and something happened and it's twisted okay i cannot explain all the time but i know you people will understand that why i started doing that so there was an emperor in those readings and here today i think after long it's the empress it's the both sides are reuniting and then the emperor and empress supposed to be together to rule on a good note it's kind of like a, on a good note love uh and i talked in there that the emperor is holding that red thread or ribbon you call it it's being presented as a red uh like it's it's pink here it's just like maybe a female version that's why so uh and i don't remember exactly was it was it red but whatever that is it's a ribbon it's a thread a red thread story if you know twin flames so no matter if they are not in the picture right now you're not in their picture right now it's supposed to be it is what it is it's like looking in each other's direction why because universe wants it the 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 sun god ra giving life to this connection maybe it's again maybe why because you have two of chalices which is the proof okay so um yeah you never let go they never let go kind of it's just the situation that might have happened in the mid where you parted ways or individual scenarios you were supposed to be coming together this is such a proof it's a proof of love it's a proof of reconnection reunion there's going to be proof of reunion both of you are going to see each other like in the wonder in one direction and that's how reunion uh, reunions happen like when you see together when you want to work together when you want to put energy together so there you emperor and you are their empress or however vice versa sun's energy like kind of like the reflection the light the mirror you usually use some light right if it's a natural it's a natural light i see it's something is connected with the promise they want to fulfill or the promise you know you made possible or the promise that is supposed to be happening now it is this this was always written this this was written no chaos it was always written to come back together to bounce back to each other each other it's interesting yes someone is saying speak to me 
because it's it's a burden. They need uh, this uh, release. Something um, that is stuck. Like a lot of communication is left. A lot of pages, a lot of texts, a lot of calls, they're left. And unless and until you just remove every sword and discuss everything, it ain't going anywhere. This connection is still there, even if it's ten of swords. Whatever is, whatever is. So you people need to discuss that. Everything is connected, circling. I feel like once you, you both do it, it's such a relaxation. It's going to, because everything is green otherwise. Everything is green. There's so much left to talk. Like, it's not giving me that energy of something negative. It's just like you taking your energy and believing in that and being powerful that the way you are, whether you're female or male, listen to me. But also it's not giving me negative why? because it's day. Nothing is dark. Nothing is night. It's more of like uh, holding on to that situation. And someone being under your spell, like kind of, I feel like it's more than even 10 years. Could be 10 for some of you. There is someone, now this can apply on you as well, but there is someone who may be feeling like caught up in, caught up in something, a web, a, a rope, they don't want to be in. They want to complete that so that if it is like reunion with you, which I see, they just want to be with you. So if they are in certain connection or marriage or relation, whatever that is, and it's not working, kind of like you people are both made for each other. 12, 12 recording time. Yes, you're made for each other. So there's going to be a solid reflection. And oh my, oh yes, Queen of Swords. Handling something properly in the coming time is going to be the biggest, biggest topic or deal for you. Now, Queen of Swords could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, something is going to get solidified. Okay, interesting. What that is, I feel reunion. It's going to get solidified. Um, so solid promise coming true. Solid things. Yes, whatever that is solid, it's going to be written. That's true. It's coming true. Like as if like nothing is more important than you. There's a laughter. That's why I laughed. There's laughter. As if like you are the reason they've been waiting on. Or um, you'll be the one, you're the reason to pull stress out of this situation you're the reason you are the one you're the one to balance things temperance could be Sagittarius but I need a flip why you're not giving what is the problem hmm? give, me this, give me the cards Something is in a is is three. Something is three. Three days to come, three weeks to come, change or months to come, change. For the start, beginning, travel, something is a meeting. But three could be a triangle. A three could be um, a competition. Three could be heavy reunion but three could be the involvement uh, could be their relation could be yours or it's, it's, it's something is three I mean they may be married you maybe I don't know what that is right now all I can see is something is three uh, 
maybe this is a this is for the third time you're going to you started talking with the third time you're going to meet or third time something is going to happen could be third meeting but with the three i can say definitely there's some involvement even if in their life or your life if it's in their life uh, and it's not about getting rid no it's just about Who belongs to I don't know they belong with you you belong with them star card it's a destiny call it's a relocation redirection new direction but yes especially reunion redirection people are coming in contact again star could be an Aquarius this is an important phase of your life where you people are going to touch each other's life once again after no talk after the saw moment or after something that can never take place And you know what? They see you as a very strong personality or however this can go as a versa. But they see you as a very strong personality. They know you are very strong. But they find you very adorable as well. But you are a strong, adorable personality. Okay. Now, this is going to be something that was destined. And both of you, male and female, masculine and feminine energy, they're coming together. As in specific genders as well, male, female, okay? Coming in this time frame to connect or reconnect. Because I feel like you people are going to be home to each other. Whether it's in romantic or friendship or something. It's time to discuss, it's time to pull out swords, it's time to pull out pain from each other's life. And only you people can do it because you have something very special. And this can take you anyways in any form. What you're going to build from this but yes right now look at this i told you ace of chalices they're in love with you it's it's a reflection of love it's something is connected with full moon as well the harvest moon kind of happened ten of pentacles <laughs> solid love mm, loyalty communication some kind of commitment mm. This is going to be, it's a love thing. It's a love language. It's something that is going to pull out swords from each other's life. And the pain is going to release. A lot of forgiving and uh, discussion, I can see. A lot of forgive, forgiving energy. Because something couldn't happen because of whatever. And it's person to person, okay, of course. But it's going to be released. Okay, what is Peekaboo in the future? Oh, very interesting. So many so many things will happen. Oh, wow. Nine of chalices with king of pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn could be listener. I wanted to say listener or dealer. I said believer. <laughs> you people are believer. And you people are believing each other to know about each other. Look at this. The bottom energy again. Knight of chalices. Something is coming. Sincerity. You hold a very special place and it's beyond sign and all that, but the energy is sincere love. Someone's wish is coming true because they sincerely asked for this. This was supposed to be, this is a, this is a connection of twin, um, okay, spiritual as well, but uh, more beyond than that, this is a love connection, which is on all levels and yes. It's kind of like someone being thirsty for your love means in a good way, okay? Not lust. I'm talking about thirsty for love and this connection in which I see is coming. Water is coming in the area. I feel like because of you, however this can go as a but because of you, do you see like any, any pain is going and everything is going away and grass is now fuller. There's no, there's a declutter, okay? And it's something that is going to freshen up and they're going to feel more confident in something or they're going to feel more responsible for something they're growing it's everything is green okay because they are connected connecting with you because they are in love with you yes attraction it never went away attraction is there attraction was there yes they look at your eyes even if you're not looking, you're worthy of love. Someone is bringing love rose to you. Interesting. 
Take care and see you soon. Bye-bye.